Welcome back for calendar. Our month is still March. We're gonna add another day to March. What's one more than 23? You're right, 24. So we're gonna put 24 right here. So we've had 24 days of March so far. Let's see what day of the week it is. We'll slide up. This starts with a T. That goes T, T. So this says Tuesday. So today is Tuesday, March 24th. Let's go ahead and check the weather. The weather where I am is partly cloudy. So I'm going to add another box where it says partly cloudy. So now I have one, two, three, four, five partly cloudy days. Pause the video now and color in what the weather is at your house. All right, let's add another day of kindergarten. So far we've had 132 days of kindergarten. We're gonna add another one to our ones place. Now we have three ones, so we're gonna change this to a three. Now we're on the 133rd day of kindergarten. Let's count all the way to 60 today. Can you count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Did you make it all the way to 60 without making any mistakes? Now we're gonna solve two story problems. So let's read the problem first. Andrew fed two cats and three dogs. How many pets did he feed in all? So first he fed two cats. Let's use pictures to help us solve this problem. So I'm going to add two cats. So Andrew fed two cats, which we have right here, and three dogs. So now I need to add three dogs. Awesome. Now they're asking us, how many pets did he feed in all? So first we had two cats, and then we added three more dogs. And we know from doing our number bonds that two and three makes five. But let's double check and make sure that's right by counting our pictures. There's one, two, three, four, five pets in all. So we were right, five. So this says two plus three equals five. Let's do one more problem together. All right, this problem says, in the garden, I saw seven bees on one flower and two bees on another flower. How many bees were there in all? So when we see the word in all, that means that they want to know all together. What does seven and two make when you put it all together? So let's start with seven bees first. So we started with seven bees, and then there were two more bees. So let's write our seven first. Seven and two more. Hmm, what does that make? Let's count the bees and see how much that makes. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So now we know that seven and two make nine. Awesome, that's it for calendar today. I wanna to give you a special challenge to try. I'd like you to try to make a pattern with things that you see around your house. At my house, I made a pattern with my cereal this morning. Can you do something like that?